All right, the purpose of this video is to address some online scandal and some gossip. Um, this is just Guy now. Survive no longer exists. Uh, the company is insolvent and is headed towards bankruptcy, but uh, the business is in negative money. So uh, I just wanted to lay this out here. I am working on wrapping up the last couple of years of taxes uh, ahead of filing for bankruptcy, but uh, I was getting pushed out of my shop um, and my equipment was about to be repossessed. So rather than uh, reactively letting that happen, I proactively liquidated the shop equipment and assets, uh, anything that wasn't a customer knife or knife blank, knife part, uh, which is here, which I'm going to go over. But um, that settled my liens, and beyond that, any other proceeds were very quickly eaten up with customer chargebacks. Uh, so the company is completely insolvent. Uh, the company is actually in negative money. I have no ability to carry on the business. Uh, I signed a uh, voluntary compliance order uh, with the Pennsylvania State to, I agreed to wind this down and not own Survive or any other knife company or manage a knife company. Uh, anything beyond being an employee of a knife company, I'm barred from doing. So uh, I just wanted to quickly show everybody that there's nothing nefarious going on here. Uh, the company just ran out of money. One too many things happened. Uh, I've made plenty of videos outlining that. Whether people choose to believe it or not, it's factually correct. So I just wanted to show everybody. Uh, the components are here in a series of bins, boxes. Uh, anything that remotely had any value is here in the storage unit while I hang out here and eventually find out what I'm supposed to do with this through the court. Um, so anybody thinking that I'm running around the, the Caribbean or something in an 80 meter yacht, that is not the case. Uh, I've put everything into this. I don't have a car. I don't, I'm technically homeless. I'm staying with a friend. I have no savings. I have nothing but personal debt as well. Um, I'm hoping to get a job here to avoid personal bankruptcy, but so far, uh, jobs are kind of hard to come by within walking distance. Uh, not having a car definitely hamstrings things a bit, but, uh, here's all the components, everything I was unable to get finished. Uh, these are mostly hardened blanks in this bin, um, things that I was almost able to get done, but we just ran out of time and gas to, to do that. So uh, that's what was in there. These are mostly annealed blanks and some other things I had to throw in where we just kind of ran out of time to get stuff out of the shop. Uh, I've got a mix of my personal things and different things in here, but uh, there's some more GSO 12s in here and then uh, a bunch of just rough cut blanks. So uh, that's what's going on here. These are bins of sheaths, almost finished knives. Uh, I've got some EDC 3s here. Uh, GSO 4.7s, all the things. Uh, a lot of this was almost brought home. So that's what's going on here. And just lots of bins of things. So uh, I'm not allowed to operate a business, so uh, I'm not able to interact with customers anymore, generate business sales. Um, I have no place to work to finish any of this out. So uh, I was over here to grab some blanks for a guy that I started a project for that uh, I was unable to follow through, but that's uh, his stuff there. And I uh, just want to return his property to him. But yeah, that's, uh, that's it. So that's a combination of my life here and just the things. So I hope that answers any question, clears up any confusion, but that's what's been going on. So anyway, uh, have a great day and I'm sorry to those I let down. But, um, you know, I, I can't push this any further. So I just got to call it and start to think about my own life and future. So that's what I'm doing. Um, this might be the last time you hear from me. Uh, if it is, I'm sorry to everybody. And, yeah, you won't see me online anymore. Uh, just to clarify and clear up any confusion here. Uh, this was for an OEM customer. This was their, their steel. We did a water jet service, but uh, I was unable to get these wrapped up and back to them before I had gotten kicked out of my shop. So, um, Chris, I'm going to get these back to you. Uh, I've got to get some supplies scratched together to get these wrapped up, but, uh, I'll get your stuff back to you and sorry about the delay on that. Anyway, to everybody else, uh, again, like I said, I apologize. Uh, I put everything into this 
So uh, I've just got to move on with my life at this point. I'm really sorry.